Okay, so um, before we, we actually uh, go ahead and uh, get involved with the load balancer, um, we are going to need a uh, container registry. Now, um, before I did this, I actually ran the registry off my um, Windows machine, uh, but I'd like to actually see if uh, we can get the built-in registry of micro Kubernetes working, which will be a very neat uh, solution because then you can... Uh, tag and push the images uh, from your dev machine um, uh, to your test environment or your, UA, um, your UAT or, or uh, staging environment if you're using micro Kubernetes in it. So <clears throat> uh, without further ado, let's have a look at this. So using uh, the built-in registry. So that seems to be quite simple. Uh, we're just going to go, uh, well, let's just have a look at how you would do that. Um, let's just first have a look at all the add-ons because this is quite useful to see. So you just run micro Kubernetes status. Um, so we're just going to do that. Okay, so we can see micro Kubernetes is running, dashboard is running, DNS is not enabled, all these things is uh, disabled. Um, the um, load balancer we want to uh, configure and run later is going to be this uh, metal LB. So it's a metal load balancer. Um, and then the registry is disabled as well. And that's basically when you're running the built-in registry that you're going to go to the built-in registry page and you're just going to say micro Kubernetes enable registry. Okie dokie, so the registry is enabled. Now, um, to test it, you'll see we not, I don't think I even have, I should not have Docker on here. Ah, great stuff, that's precisely what I want. I don't even have Docker installed on my two Ubuntu machines, and that is the point. So, <clears throat> um, the next thing to do, um, is that we want to, uh, I'm, I'm using uh, Docker for Windows, um, also with a, a local Kubernetes thing installed. So um, let me just see if I can actually open Docker here. And I think it's under settings. Settings. Um, I just want to see where this was. Okay, yes. So you go to your Docker icon, uh, you click on settings, uh, you scroll down, um, and you'll see there's a, um, a insecure. Uh, registries uh, thing here. I'm actually running. You can you can have multiple registries running. So. Um, what we will do now is we will say this one is called Ubuntu one dot local, and the port is this thirty two thousand. Um, okay, and we're just going to apply it. Okay, great stuff. Let's just see what happens. <clears throat> so my expectation with this is that once it starts up that I can go into the Docker command line and we can do a very basic test with uh, Nginx, uh, deploy an Nginx um, image uh, that we download into our local uh, uh, Docker images and then push it to this uh, registry in, in um, the micro Kubernetes cluster. So I'm just going to wait for this uh, to restart and when I'm ready we'll continue with the next uh, section. <clears throat> 